All right, guys, all right, guys. It's Marty, you know, back here another work vlog, work vlog, work vlog. Anyway, guys, so it's early today. You know, I gotta drive all the way to Lincoln City and everything. Uh, uh, so anyway, guys, right now, uh, we just drive in and everything. But guys, I caught a little bit of the news, you know, I didn't catch very much, you know, because, you know, I had to get up and go, you know, because it takes me like almost an hour to get to Lincoln City. So anyway, guys, uh, uh, these, uh, like DHS agents, you know, I think that's the Homeland Security people. They can't uh, have their horses anymore because they're trying like, to secure the border and whatnot. But all these uh, uh, people from Haiti are coming in. And then I was thinking, I go, I go, wait a second, wait a second. Isn't Haiti an island? So uh, I, I believe Haiti's an island or they're by like uh, the Dominican Republic and like Cuba and whatnot. So it makes sense that they just go north and you know, like hit, hit like Cuba and like Florida, but no, they're going west and then north. So how are they ending up in Mexico? That's what I'm thinking. Like how are all these Haitians ending up in Mexico? You know, cause it just doesn't make much sense to me. Unless the, someone like shipped them all to Mexico and was like, hey, you want to go to America? Uh, we'll pay you to go to Mexico and then just like uh, hightail it up to up to Texas and everything, you know. So it kind of seems a little fishy, guys. kind of seems a little fishy because, first of all, you want an island. You know, how are you getting off the island, first of all? And then how are you getting to Mexico? And Mexico is way far away from where you're at, too, and, and everything. So, I don't know. All these, uh, like, uh, Depart Department of Homeland Security people and everything, they're all getting handicapped, guys. They can't do their job. Like, the regular police force in America can't even do their job because all the all the woke wokeness and everything, you know? Because you guys know what they say. If you go woke, you go broke and everything. So I don't know, guys. I don't know, guys. Anyway, guys. Also, I heard some lady, uh, uh, they were looking for this lady that went to a Chipotle restaurant. And uh, she was like, uh, she's like, hey, can I have some tacos? And they're like, oh, we're closing, ma'am. And then she pulled out a gun and she was like, make my tacos. Make my tacos. I've had a bad day. I want some tacos. And then they're like, whoa, whoa, whoa. You know, so. There's some crazy people out there and everything. I think guys, I think guys, I watched Ted Lasso last night. I watched Ted Lasso. Man, guys, Ted Lasso, he going through, this, through some stuff. I mean, he going through some stuff like emotional, like traumatic, you know, like childhood stuff. Man, you thought Ted Lasso was like a good comedy and everything? No, man, Ted Lasso's deep, man. It's deep and everything. You know, check out Ted Lasso because, you know, stuff be going down in Ted Lasso. Anyway, guys, I'll come back to all you when we get to uh, Lincoln City and we'll see how the rest of the day's been going. So see you soon, see you soon. Shoo. All right guys, all right guys, all right guys. We made it. So we made it here at Lincoln City and everything, you know. There was actually a little bit of traffic, you know. I was surprised because, you know, it's like almost, uh, what is time is it? What time is it? Oh, it's almost six o'clock, you see? You see that? You see that? See, almost six o'clock, so. Anyway guys, so the reviews, I'll be putting out the reviews uh, at 5.30 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. For all you people that, 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 that don't know, that's what it's going to be, you know, it's going to be one review, you know, a day, and I'm going to try to make it, you know, like, like something uh, uh, really relevant, like today's review is about uh, uh, that, uh, uh, some, some celebrity mail at Burger King, I forget what it was, little, little hoodie or little, some, 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 some sort of celebrity mail, anyway guys, check out the video, see what I thought, anyway, so we got to uh, get in to go to work right now, so I'll see all you when I see you, I guess I guess I guess so now just got done at the first stop you know we got grocery outlet now and everything so guys 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 I got something to tell you I got something to tell you so I saw an old co-worker of mine uh, and at this store I was just at and you know she told me she goes Marty did you hear the news and I go what news Lori and she goes Marty uh, there was a big shooting at a Kroger store in like uh, Tennessee I believe and I go what another one because there was like a, a shooting at a Kroger branded branded store uh, in Colorado a little bit ago, or maybe a while back ago, and uh, I was like, geez, <laughs> so, if you work for Kroger, watch out, guys, watch out, it seems like they're targeting Kroger stores, so, or maybe just Kroger doesn't treat their employees well, you know, you know, maybe, <laughs> I, I think it could even be one there, it's, it's either Kroger really doesn't treat their employees well, and they get disgruntled, and, you know, stuff goes down, or they just, or as people that are unstable see Kroger as a soft target, and, you know, just... Pop, 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 you know, and everything, you know, you know, who knows, who knows, who knows. Anyway, guys, come back to all you on lunchtime when we see how the rest of the day's been going. So see you soon, see you soon. 
Alright guys, alright guys, so guess what, I was just in grocery outlet, you know, working, working, you know, putting some stuff away and everything, and guess what I saw guys, guess what I saw, I saw these high key cereals for $1.99, you see these high key, they protein cereals and whatnot, it says plant based protein cereal, no sugar added, FOMO, no mo, it says frosted, keto friendly, 16 grams of protein, gluten free, you see that? Buck 99, buck 99 guys, buck 99. I got two of them, I got two of them. They also had a fruity flavor, but I believe I already tried the fruity flavor because my brother-in-law had the fruity flavor because his wife's uh, uh, been getting on to him about being fat and everything. And, he, and uh, she's like, hey, you need to lose weight. And he's like, I'm fine the way I am. And she's like, no, you're not. You need to lose weight. And he's, and he's like, he's like, what do you think? And I go, you a beautiful snowflake. <laughs> you know, because I was like, like, you find the way you are. And she's like, hmm. You know, because she wants him to go on a diet and everything. But she just had another kid, so I don't know if she's one to talk, you know. But I digress. I digress. Anyway, guys, so, you know, moral of the story. If you fat and you like being fat, stay fat, you know, as long as it's not affecting your health, you know. But as soon as it starts affecting your health, maybe you should get get in the gym or, or, or anything, you know. So if it's affecting your health, get, get in shape, get in shape. But if, if you're completely fine and you're just loving life, stay fat, you know. But hey, I ain't no doctor or nothing. I'm just some guy on YouTube, you know, disclaimer, disclaimer. Anyway, guys, so we got that. We also got these uh, little secret uh, chocolate bars things, you know, see these? So these guys were only 50 cents, guys. 50 cents, 50 cents for this. So check it out. Grocery outlet. You know, bog and muck. Anyway, guys, come back to all of you on lunch break. See you soon. Alright, guys, alright, guys, alright, guys. So now it's lunchtime and everything. You know, work's been going good. Work's been going good. But, uh, you know, these small stores, it's all like hand trucks or whatnot. So, you know, kind of hurt my back, you know. So I got me something, a little something to drink and whatnot. You know, I didn't want to get me uh, myself a drink, you know, because I was like, ah. I'm trying to wean myself off these energy drinks, energy drinks, but you guys know I'll be, I'll be tired, you know, working so much last night and having to wake up so early. I gotta wake up like at four in the morning to drive all the way here to Lincoln City. You know, luckily, I'm not like my coworker uh, Pancho Villa. You know what he had to do, guys? Yeah, he had to drive all the way to Tillamook, guys. So that guy must have had to wake up at like a, at like two in the morning or something, you know, to get ready. You know, good thing I didn't have to go to uh, uh, Tillamook, you know. Because that's not even in our district, so I don't even know why he's going to Tillamook. It's not even in our district, you know. Anyway, anyway, I digress, so. Anyway, work's been going good, you know. I'm getting it done, guys. It's heating up, though. It's heating up. You know, I, I think they said it's supposed to be in the uh, mid-70s today, you know. And jeez, guys, it's almost October. Like, what the heck? What the heck, you know. We need more days like rain, you know, to get rid of those, uh, those all those wildfires or whatever, you know. I think they're still happening, you know. I don't know, I don't know, but... You know, we don't need any more any more heat. You know, we need uh, we need a little bit of a little bit of rain and everything. You know, get those uh, crops to grow and whatnot. Well, I guess they wouldn't be growing right now this time of year. But you guys, know, you guys know we need some rain. We need some rain. Anyway, guys, hopefully you're you're enjoying the today's work vlog, work vlog, work vlog. Anyway, just stay tuned. See what happens next. You know, who knows? Who knows? Anyway, guys, come back to all of you sometime. All right, stay tuned. All right, guys, all right, guys. So I just got down to this place and everything. You know. Today went a little bit longer than it should have, but you know, it's freaking hot, guys. It's hot though. See, look at this. Weather for Lincoln City, Oregon. It's currently clear. So it says 68 degrees, but I don't believe that. Uh, let's see about Newport. Weather for Newport, Oregon. It's currently clear. Yeah, 71. I don't know, guys. Whatever happened to fall, you know? It's supposed to be fall time weather. Anyway, guys, I'll come back to all of you. When we get uh, to Newport, you know, hopefully arrive, they're all safe and sound and whatnot. And then, uh, we'll see all you again tomorrow. So, we'll see you when we get to Newport, you know. And, uh, see you soon. Alright guys, alright guys, so we made it back to Newport all safe and sound. And, you know, I texted my buddy Toby, and I was like, hey Toby, you guys at Rogue today? And he was like, yeah, we at Rogue. And I was like, ah, I'll be there in around, like, 15 minutes or so. He was like, ah, we should still be around here. So, you see where we're at, guys, right now? The Rogue Nation. Alright guys, so we'll come back to all of you when we get out of here and we'll see how these guys have been doing. So see you soon, see you soon. Alright guys, alright guys, alright guys. So we just got out of Rogue, you know, visiting with some peoples. Anyway guys, so I saw Warehouse Greg and it's been a long time since I've seen that guy and everything. You know, he's doing good, he's doing good and everything. So, you know, saw all the other guys, you know, it was just Toby's birthday last week. Anyway guys, it was good seeing him, good seeing him. Anyway, so that's just the end of today's work vlog, work vlog, work vlog. Anyway, back at it again tomorrow. So. You know, just stay tuned, you know, uh, smash that like button for YouTube algorithm, and I'll see all you tomorrow, so just make sure you like, comment, subscribe, you know, take care of yourself, be kind of willing, you know, keep spreading some good vibes only.
And you know, stay tuned for the future reviews, you know. I got some uh, high key cereal, you know, frosted, and uh, uh, chocolate, you know. Sometimes, sometimes I'll put them out. Anyway guys, stay tuned for all that stuff, and I'll see you tomorrow. Marty out.